t-shirt and TV. Two American icons, so to speak, so it may not be too surprising then that an American company has managed to combine the two into a product, indeed a concept, called, well, t-shirt TV. When the Forbes.com video network returns, the digital life's Eric Hesseldahl will introduce us to the man behind the idea and show us how it works. Traditional marketing is a problem. People are watching less TV, reading fewer newspapers, and that makes them harder to reach for advertisers and marketers. So they're starting to turn to new ways to reach people in the places where they congregate and circulate. We're here with an interesting company that has a new idea for marketing. I'm here with Adam Hollander of uh, Brand Marketers of San Francisco and with Judith Glant, and we're talking about, uh, about this. Adam, what is this? Tell us about this. Well, this is T-Shirt TV and it's an excellent way to take your advertising straight to the consumer. It's uh, active, instead of being passive and expecting the consumer to watch uh, your TV spot at home, we bring that spot straight to them wherever they live, work, or play. And what do you call it? I mean, what do you physically call the t-shirt? We call it t-shirt TV, but it doesn't just have to be a t-shirt. We could put it in, you know, any, any article of clothing. We've done it in basketball jerseys before, and it's, it's just limitless. Mm -hmm. You've worked with several, several uh, large companies uh, for, for marketing campaigns, have you not? Can you tell us yes, about we have, that? Yes, we've worked with 20th Century Fox, uh, recently did this program for the DVD release of Entourage with HBO. Uh, we've done the Republican National Convention with MSNBC, uh, Def Jam Records for LL Cool J at the Video Music Awards. Uh, we're doing a program for SBC, uh, going to movie theaters as well. Mm -hmm. And and so the, the your business is basically to hire out models wearing like Judith here, wearing the uh, wearing the T-shirts and going wherever you sent them. It, what we do is uh, we hire wonderful people that are very uh, outgoing and friendly. We call them brand ambassadors because when they go out, they're truly ambassadors of that brand. And they play, uh, we brand the shirts completely, and they play whatever type of medium, uh, whatever type of media the company wants. First of all, I want to know, is it comfortable to wear? And second, what kind of reaction do you get from people when you, when you work on these campaigns? Yes, everybody would like to know that, and it's very comfortable, very lightweight. And uh, usually people, you know, first they pay attention to the sound and they look where is this coming from and they see the t-shirt with a TV in it. So, you know, that's when we get a lot of atten attention to see what the, what's going on on the t-shirt, what we are advertising, mm -hmm. so. And, and, and what kind of questions or reactions do you get from people once they realize that, hey, this is a person wearing a TV in their t-shirt? They want to know how it works. Uh, they want to know if they can change the channel, mm -hmm. like, uh, if they can touch the screen, if it's a touch screen, just the craziest questions right, too. Right, so. right. And are they generally more interested in the technology itself or, in, or do they also get engaged by the message? Well, because first they pay attention to the t-shirt itself. Mm -hmm. That's why we catch their attention and that's, you know, then they watch what we are playing on the, on the t-shirt. And Adam, it doesn't just play video, it also has sound capabilities as well. Oh, it? it has very impressive sound. Let me show you. And that certainly uh, would get a lot of attention. Yeah, usually the audio grabs people first and then they come running up, you know, and say, what is that? Wow. That's interesting. Uh, how, do you, how do you like being remote controlled, I guess? <laughs> now, I hate to invoke the Teletubbies, but it reminds me, I mean, we basically have a video screen. Can you tell us a little about the technology involved? Video screen embedded into a t-shirt. What, what have you got in, inside of it? Uh, well, inside of this is a customized, um, a computer system that can play any type of media anywhere. It has audio, it plays full motion video, um, it could be unlimited length. Um, you know, we could control it now with a laptop computer, so we send the media to it with a wireless uh, signal, and we could change between programs, um, you know, at the touch of a button. And who, who actually made the shirt? Was that, was that you or was that? Uh, at this, this, this shirt that we're looking at now, the original I made, and now we're working with uh, engineers that are smarter and more technically advanced, you know, than I am. Generally speaking, what does one of these cost to, to build? To produce, well, you know, we're at a unit cost of, you know, probably uh, several thousand dollars right now, but that's also because we've put a lot of money into research and development, so it's hard to calculate, you know, the exact cost, and then it also varies on well, how many units do we make at one time and what capabilities, because we can make them very robust 
or we can make them a little bit you know, less where they, they can't do quite as many features. And I bet you guys get asked all the time, where can I get one? You, you don't actually sell these uh, on a unit by unit basis, do you? Yeah, at this time, we don't sell them. We just use them as a tool for non-traditional advertising and marketing campaigns. Um, down the road, we may look at uh, selling them to companies to use you know, on greeters when you walk into a, a store or you know, when you walk into a ballpark or something like that. Thanks very much for being with us here. Thank sure. you both. Thank and you. for more of your technology and marketing coverage, look at Forbes.com.